Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris, Grand Admiral No Scaling. I'm your host, Color Fade. It's episode 21. We're putting together our fleets. And prepping our bastions for what we know Ships will be upgraded. the inevitable arrival of the crisis. And in the meantime... Need to build research complete <laughs> down to 63. We're upgrading ships, and so it's that's why we're seeing that happen, and that's why the numbers keep disappearing like that. You're seeing the alloys be allocated, and just as quickly as we can allocate them, they disappear. It's because of all the ships we have queued up to upgrade. Because we have dark matter deflectors and all that stuff, and we need everybody to be fully upgraded. Mob rule on Verdant. Mob rule on these criminals, criminal jobs. Decisions. Now you can do a bunch of stuff. You can declare martial law. Mastery of Ships nature. upgraded. Oh, yeah, I still do have all of that, don't I? <laughs> Create a resort world. Hmm. I, I, mean, I think I've done that one time, but <clears throat> I'm not 100% sure. Mastery of nature. I'm only going to do that because we're getting close to the ceiling there. Vertimon. So, Vertimon, what can we do about you? You have... I'm just going to make Construction a few more enforcers complete. then. <laughs> They're just short people. There's, an, It's like an empty planet. They have a bunch of police people and then they just have criminals and that's it. Ships upgraded. That's funny. Oh, yeah, we can't make this. <laughs> and the... The uh, minus... That what we're losing, the reason we're losing so much money is because we're buying a bunch of of this. And it's very expensive. We've driven up the price by buying it so much. So now it's 25.8. That's probably the highest I've ever seen it. So the massive amount that we're buying is, is what's costing that. So before we can upgrade anything else, we just need to keep producing and we have lots of ring worlds here to help and and so here's a bad thing that we did um, this ring world doesn't even have enough people on it construction complete <clears throat> to take all these jobs we put a bunch of refinery resources on here and we do need these but on these planets here we're much better off with these production. These Barty Ring World ones. See, we put them on this one. That was smart. We got them here. They're probably going to need a few more. I'm going to make this here. Because, like, they're down to one amenity, and that's not good enough. Let's give them some more. These produce some amenities, don't they? No, it just produces trade. Or does it? The amenities are the little musical notes. Okay. Yeah, this doesn't produce. Oh, it produces plus 10 of those. Uh, okay. The faux show habitat. Research complete. In this ring world, we went to more <coughs> research. So, and they have tons of people. It's just tons of jobs. I mean, 58 jobs. So, all we can really do is wait for people to grow. We're back up to 1K. So, what I'm going to do is press this and see how big of a number we can make it. 
before we start to lose money. And we still have that to fire off everything. So that helps. Now we can tell this game we can start to decide to go. So since we took some gases off, I'm going to put some on some other worlds. You got what? Gas extraction was but only one. Research is at 37, 25k. Okay, what did we get it to at last time during the Doomsday series? Did we get it in the 60s? I thought we did. We had it up there. It was very big. Korovan. What would we like to do with the Korovan? Well, let's go with um, industrial districts, I think. And make it a forge well. Ships upgraded. Research complete. One of the things I need is I scroll down here. <clears throat> Very cool. Energy weapon damage. Shame. We almost got it. Ocean will. Yeah, we were saying. Let's do. Let's do the same thing here. Let's just go industrial districts. Because that really is what we're going to need. We just need massive amounts of alloys to start taking advantage. Sky Haven Temple. Okay. Well, what do we got left here? You can take this and replace it. I do first now 61 30 61 38 okay that works you don't have enough this though you guys are very happy research you don't have complete. Enough movie theaters of nature on some of these places. That'd be the next thing to do. You can't do that on these, though. They're just done. So, let me see. What's that look like? Yeah, so you've got 21 housing and no available jobs. So this, you could take this and replace it with a leisure district. I was balancing these back and forth and never paying attention to the number. I want them to be pretty much even. I'd like it to where there'd be zero jobs and almost zero housing. That to me is balanced. So we'll take a look at some of those other habitats that are in sort of the same situation. Ships upgraded. backwards until we can find a couple more like this one. Yeah, same situation. So if you take this... Ships upgraded. 22 days. We'll see what this looks like. It, it, it still needs people, of course, to fill those jobs, but we'll have a little better idea. Because I think these only provide eight housing tops. Yeah, so you still don't even really need... And these provide three housing. You could take two of these. Yeah, you could take two of these. And turn them into leisure districts. Easy. And still have enough housing. So 
Yeah, we should do that. We should have been paying closer attention to those numbers. Order restored on Vertim. Oh, very nice. There you go. It, very happy people here in 95. It's the leisure place. Provides some extra jobs and you can see what they do. They provide pl plenty of amenities, but they also provide some research and some unity. <clears throat> it's just a happy place. But if you're going to have all of these fortress people here creating naval capacity for you, then, then you should make it happy. It's basically a red light district, right? Bunch of edicts came up. Ambitions. She got more than enough. Now we have a million. So the one planet we have with all that influence is, is doing the job. Oh, we're short. <laughs> we're short. We're short on minerals because now we're using too many. We're using too many, so we can't sell these. We're short on minerals. Ships upgraded. We're actually, gonna have to buy some. Okay, it's back to 1k. Gotta be careful with that. You gotta have enough minerals to be able to build things. But you also, every single time that you upgrade your alloy production, it's consuming a horde of those minerals. Guardian's Angel Act done. Um, change council size. Can we finally change council size to one? Yes. It says weak support. <laughs> Too bad. It's going to be us. It's me. Of course I know his name. It's me. I am the Senate. There is going to be an Obi-Wan movie, it looks like, with Ewan McGregor. I'm rather excited to see that. I think that could be really cool. I'm surprised the crisis hasn't shut up. It's 24 Research complete. End game start year is 24 50 in the end game year is 2500 so I'll give it a narrow window Let's see what happens maybe it's not hard coded to show up before that upper limit and it'll show up at like 25 12 and the game will have already been over because the screen will pop Research complete. 2500 and I'll be like yeah I'm done I just play for that victory screen it's very rewarding it, it amazes me that people will play the game and just stop like at this point in time they're probably like oh I've got it covered no problem I'm going to stop and start over it's like no 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 I have to see the victory screen it doesn't count it doesn't count otherwise Scooby Doo oh what else we got going on here is the next thing is to go check our so like this place not that one this one what are we looking at 30k for military power oh no 147k okay that's what I wanted to see 147k for that bastion that's pretty good you guys on the other hand you are tidal wave and what Your fleet manager and you can't be open why can't I open your fleet manager ships upgraded because the fleet manager for this one is stuck tidal wave. Okay, let's try something. Tidal wave doesn't want to open for us. That sounds like a personal problem. Down here. Ships out upgraded. On the corner. Down now in the street. He's got 260 days of tidal wave. So I'm gonna click this button here and I'm gonna look for tidal wave. We got all these new fleet ones. Why are they even in there? 
Paradox, what are you doing? Typhoon. I don't... So Tidal Wave can't show up. So Tidal Wave is really broken. Tidal Wave is like, dude, we're just up here by ourselves. We can't be made into a fleet. It's... Oh my gosh. You know what? Screw you. Broken ass game. You're gonna break like that. <laughs> Just gonna force me to do it the hard way, aren't you? You goobs. Ships upgraded. That's where I'm at with this. I just really, really want Paradox to fix it. I just want them to fix it. Ships That's all upgraded. I really care about. Just fix it. Just fix the really bad bugs. Just fix them. It's not... Just do it. Why don't you want to do it? That's what I don't understand is why don't you want to do it? Because you're thinking I can't make any money off of that? I just, I, 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 I have a real problem with just leaving things broken. I just Ships can't, upgraded. I can't do it. I can't do it around my house. I can't do it anywhere. It's like, I just can't leave things broken. So it really bothers me that they just, they just don't. And they formed this whole new committee. Ships upgraded. This custodians initiative. Like that's the... <laughs> What's your job then? We're gonna make sure that we take the human species pack and add two civics. I, I just don't care. I want you to fix the problem. We still can't espionage marauders and fallen empires. You know, the only way I'm getting through the game now is to just become so overwhelmingly pop powerful Ships that upgraded. I don't have to pay attention to what my enemies are using. I don't care if they're using shields or armor. I'm just going to be five times as big as them and roll over. There's no strategy there. It's not much of a strategy. Ships upgraded. It's an effective one. But it's, you know, you could go to war sooner when teams are more evenly balanced if you had that advantage of, oh yeah, I'm but they're they're using a bunch of kinetic weapons, so ships upgraded. I'm gonna counterbalance that with a bunch of armor. Ha <laughs> ha, suckers! Ships upgraded. It's just goofy to me. It just seems really goofy. Handshake you know? protocols activated. It's like, what are you... What? what? Okay, this thing. This Scooby-Doo right here. Um, how come you're just not going through the hole? Why don't you just go into there? Ships oh, upgraded. It's on a wormhole. It's, gonna put you, it's just... What's it got? Command center? Target athlete computer disk. <clears throat> You're not happening. Alright, cancel the election. Upgraded. Yeah, yeah. Gateway constructed. Good, that's this guy right here. So, we could take him. Take this guy. Point him up to there. He will now shoot through there. Ships upgraded. You could do the same thing with this dude. And this has got a little bit of. See, I got this small fleet right here. Because there's a lot of research lot of complete trade coming through here, so you can see. There's a lot of star base protection, piracy effects. It's just a lot. It's just. A, it's a lot. It's a whole lot. Alright, so down here we have 
ring roads that can be. Ring back A. guys in there. What do, what do we have for you? you can... <clears throat> Alright. Well. What do we have here? Who's trying to grab stuff Research from complete. The Skinnery. Too bad. Uh, what I wanted to do is see if I could buy this system. Zarmaton from the Evendar. I want Zarmaton. You guys won't give it to me. <sighs> that that's the game's way of letting you know it's not even a it's not even a chance. So you're saying there's a chance. Nope, I'm not. I'm saying there's no chance. You can't have this. Actually, right now because it's occupied by the Skinnery Bonded Matrix, so you can't sell it. They can't trade it. That's probably why. <clears throat> That would make a whole lot of sense. This is a Gaia world, and we will colonize it. But only with the founder species. Well, interesting. Alright, you, little science ship. Body wing D is science. Is it? Yep, it is. You can go help with that. How long does this take? Set up for four hundred ninety days. Okay. Good. Then what other resolutions can we do? Permanent council seat. <clears throat> Nominate custodian. Glock. Oh, this is what I wanted to do. Oh, I should have done that. already has a pending resolution and I can't cancel this can I withdraw can I withdraw allowing you to propose another yes oh you can oh my goodness okay I'm so happy about that all right custodian yes all right. that's what I'm talking about okay thank goodness you can withdraw one and do a different one that's nice that's really nice actually that's cool Concern there for a second. <clears throat> All right, what do you got? Yeah, yeah Ion can three years. Hope those guys don't show up before then. Then. Founding a new home. Founding. Just randomly kind of updating the crews, trying to get these. I mean, you're building them so that then later on you can just upgrade them when you realize what the heck you're up against. When it comes to you and says, it's the unbidden. Yeah, like, what are we doing with you? It's... Here we go. The 
big thing is checking on these fleets, man, making sure what the hell. You guys just go save us some money, please. What are you, gift? You're still not upgraded? How many ships you got upgraded? Alligate to terminal. What's terminal egress looking like up here? This is going to be important because there's four gateways. The Skinnery Bonded Matrix. Skinnery Bonded Merchants, I keep calling the Skinnery Bonded Matrix. Well, you know, whatever. Research complete. They're bonded. That's the important thing. They're bonded. Bond. Skinnery Bond. I'll have my galactic empire shaken, not stirred. Construction complete. Research complete. Yeah. Bring it on, punks. Not too bad for... Ships upgraded. Grand Admiral difficulty, though, huh? I don't think he can play. At least I can't. There's a lot of species that I don't think I could play in Grand Admiral. For instance, I really don't think anything Building like a new determined home. exterminators or anything like that. Yeah, I need to I need to close borders with all you guys, don't I? You keep flying through my space and stuff. Make, who are you? Where are you going? Who are all you guys? Sidrian Index? Oh, I'm going to make things hard for you. Tough. <laughs> Good luck going to war using my gateways. That ain't going to happen. Don't come through my space. Don't use my gateways. Don't use my L gates. You didn't get permission. Who are you guys? Skinnery. Yeah, you're over here. Guess what? Bye. Have fun making war that way, turkeys. Who else doesn't like me? Oh, Tizun. Diplomacy. Close borders. Yeah, hostile. Research Too bad for complete. you. The Verilov. Diplomacy. Close borders. Bye. Yeah. You guys can make war some other way. But you ain't gonna just go through, roll through my space. That ain't happening. No siree. No way, Jose. Poor Jose. Can you imagine? He's always being told no way. The guy's getting rejected right and left. My name is Jose. No way, Jose. That's just not going to help him, is it? Alright, what do we have here? We got some research over here. That failed to get New collected. frontiers established. New planets. These are the ring worlds. Very nice. Let's do... Oh, what do we want to do? Ring B. Well, let's just do research for both of them. seen this view. Rid of the blue, which is nice. The Sidran Index. Yeah. That's the thing. You could go to war, but Guardian 8. But, but in doing so, you open up yourself for the possibility that something's going to show up and you're going to have to if you if you can't status quo right at that minute and stop it and transfer all your attention to whatever that is, you're going to be in trouble. So I'm a little hesitant to go to war with anybody else and try to capture anything. 
11 days and this will fail. Then we can take our resolution and make it special. Special session. What's going on here? We're stuck on day 20. Is something magical going to happen? Crisis show up? Nope. Mm -mm. Just day 20. It was on day 20. Stuff happened. Failed. <laughs> Back to work. Who do we have over here? The Zelvin hegemony is in breach of balance in the middle. The Tizayan are in breach of balance in the middle. That's funny. And they're in breach of balance in the middle. Ooh. And the Tizayan are the slavers? Are they the slavers? The Tizayan. Slaving despots. Mutual assistance accord. And... The Skinneri are ruthless capitalists and they're part of the free science. So that's interesting. So if you wanted to, you could go to design and say declare war and do humi Oh, all we can do is humiliate. We'd have to actually go claim some of their systems too. Hmm. Okay, I see. Uh, who's over here? Skinneri, bonded merchants. The Evandry, yeah, there's, no, there's nothing there that I really want. Taking down a fallen empire would be cool. That'd be the only other thing to do is go after these bozos. The Rayen archivists. But. Hmm. Alright, I had to take a little break there, so you're getting a spliced together Stellaris episode. You guys don't have enough amenities. I have to fix that. 2461, waiting on the crisis, whatever it ends up being. Research complete. Gotta feel like it's gonna be soon, but who knows. If it gives us a little time here. Gives us more time to prep. I had to go through, I had to start recording the episodes well recording's the wrong word um what is the right word today <laughs> it's the process of of um ripping new frontiers episodes, established I guess, in an open shot because you have to have the intro and sometimes i have to splice things together and stuff like that so you get them exported into a format that youtube likes <laughs> And I had to watch that first episode all over again. And it made me realize what kind of huge bonuses the AI is going to get in the crisis. They get 150% to everything. Offense, shields, armor, all that kind of stuff. So they're going to be kind of devastating. But we knew that. Gas extraction loss. Okay. Um... <laughs> Industrial, right? Industrial, that's all we really can do here. Okay. The Forge World, I guess, they're kind of the same. Where's this at? Edamar, it's that system all by itself here. Right there. In this special place where there was the cyanic monster. So, what we'll do is give it its own boss. They don't need research from jobs person. They're not going to get any energy or minimum credits. <clears throat> so, well, unless we wanted to give them to them, unless we wanted to change it. Nah, let's pick this person. Alright. Cybrex be the Cybrex world. Cybrex, I always like getting complete. the Cybrex. That's always nice. Get that first ring world up. It's always cool. And how are we looking for resources? Our secondary resources, our refinery resources. We're not buying any, and we're in the plus 30, so that's good. And we're spending money buying quite a few monthly trades for those, for alloys, so. Looks good. Construction complete. This world is not complete. What were you doing here? Mm. 
Oh, come now. Research complete. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Come on, UI. Quit screwing around with me. Just let me get what I want. Have owl. Yeah. I know what we're doing with this world. I don't. Uh, we're definitely not leaving that bracket like that, though. Not actually sure what I'm doing. Oh, gosh. You guys keep coming up. I just want to put you on auto pay. <clears throat> hmm. Why are you here doing that? Strange. Frontier sector, Skipaton. Where is Skipaton? Where is Skippy John Jones? Over here by yourself because you can't get there because of this system. Okay. We're going to leave you. You don't need a governor. We're, we might end up getting this. Skipaton. You can live without a governor. You're going to be fine. We have to look at our star bases, though. All the B ones. Make sure they're still building. And if they're not building, are they done? Yes. That's a B1, and it's not quite done. Target top. Tor. Research complete. Uh, yeah. Research completed. Ships upgraded. Oh, good. Because you're building an ion cannon. Okay. You're done. You're completely done. So you can build your ion cannon. Research complete. Research complete. Because the crisis is coming, we're not going to need to focus on making our army stronger. You won't need armies. Shouldn't anyway. I like seeing these guys done. That's nice. He's building. <clears throat> He's done. Yeah, he's got this last computer here. Command center. Fire rate. Canine cannon. And what about the mega shipyards? Good deal. <clears throat> and the other mega shipyard right here. Same situation. Building. And now we're down to 1.7. It goes fast. Very fast. <clears throat> Alright. When that gets built back up, we'll take a look at all of our ships here. What is this? We have a Titan out here by ourselves? Oh no, just two battleships. Hmm, okay. Where are you guys at? You're moving. Oh, you're automatically patrolling. Where? Right there? Oh. I see. You have a bunch of Corvettes with you. There's crashing wave. And where are you? Why don't you come over here and join crashing wave? They can probably use you. Lots of ships. I like seeing all these 300k ones. We're going to need them to be as strong as we can. It certainly is tempting to go to war with somebody. They're all at war with each other, which is really funny. What's on the floor? Nominate custodian. Galactic Fies at I Empire. Everybody likes that. And can you blame them? Castigation. The Tropokian Collective. I'll support that measure. That'll jump that up to the next. I love it when our power gets that high and we can push things around like that. That's cool. Repeal the Tayanki Cancer Conservation Act? No. Uh, 
oppose this stuff. Repeal balance in the middle. Oppose. Repeal buzzword standardization. Oppose. There's going to be san sanctions. So, we'll just oppose all of those. Natural sanctuaries. Diplomatic weight from economy. Oppose. Leverage property. Hey, we'd support that, but I'm going to leave this here. With their th the only thumbs up so that goes next. <laughs> What does this do? Modify it if it's denounced. The diplomatic weight goes down. <laughs> Denouncement. That's funny. Somebody proposed that. Who proposed that? Can you see who proposed it? Oh, you can. The Sovereign Julian <laughs> Confederation. That's funny. <clears throat> Active modifiers. Diplomatic weight from economy. Oh. Why did that happen? From collective waste management? Nope. Galactic market. Research complete. Mm. <laughs> Let's take a look at our species. Oh, like these guys. Look, there's a bunch of them. They got. got Situation several. log updated. I'll take all of them out. Like seeing these numbers switch. The Bacturian. Species enhanced. Oh, look at you guys. Switched over. There's 10 of you there. Situation log updated. These guys have 22. Just gotta watch the months roll by gets to the end of the month and then it happens day one I'm gonna switch everybody over species enhanced situation log updated and it, these guys don't need to be switched right here because a lot of them are on ring worlds I saw there but you know we're gonna make everybody the same they're all fleeing those wars, which is why they're coming to our empire. Which is fine. We need the pops. We got ring worlds and other planets to colonize, so. Species enhanced. Yep. I like it when I'm Situation log so updated. Oh, the glur. They have got a bunch of stuff here. Aerodite, researcher, volatile excretions, yeah talented oh yeah we made these guys these ones right here they have a lot of stuff you can see why people like to play void dwellers i mean that's a lot of stuff and they get some really cool benefits each pop working as a slave or better produces species enhanced. volatile modes i mean come on. situation log updated i've never played a void dweller but i shouldn't have... oh here we go here's the gulp fear cab of this Let's take this and create a template from that. So we need this. Get rid of that, 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 that. Leader experience gain. Leader level cap. Nice. Okay. Oh, we lose, we lose the scions though? Hold on. No, they're right there. I have to go down one more. Okay. Cool. Yeah, we get this. Psionic. They get that extra bonus to research, which is just so sweet. We get Species all enhanced. Too. Situation log updated. Two months for those guys. Okay. Then we'll keep going. Research complete. A weapon attack speed and damage. I don't know that. I don't know that shields are going to help us a whole lot, but we'll put some points. We'll poke some points into it because. Those dark matter deflectors, we may end up getting the the proper crisis. Look at these guys. They're starting to take it all over. Hmm. I, wish, I wish somebody didn't belong to a federation. I'd go after them. The keepers of knowledge don't. We could go after them. And the benevolent interventionists, they have 10. Where are they at? Over here. Hmm. No easy access. 
That's the problem. Species enhanced. Oh, look at you guys. How nice. <clears throat> those guys, that's awesome. 216 of those in my empire. Woo. Okay, half glur. Half glur? No, you don't get me half glur. What's this? Ingenious? Where's the jobs one? That one, there you go. Half glur. Situation log updated. Half glur. These guys, half zelvins, they need some. They get the psionic trait, that's always nice. We'll make them workers. Oops. Oh, I hate it when it does that. It scrolls all the way back up. Dang it. Half gore, whatever they were. Oh. Species enhanced. This. Come on, Paradox. I'm only asking for a little bit here. Half job and end. Situation log updated. Yeah, so there's no easy access over here, is there? No wormholes. Oh, there's a gateway right there. Because this is our space. <laughs> there is easy access if we want to build a gateway right there. Well, in that case, let's go make a gateway. And if the gateway gets built and the crisis still isn't up here, we'll come over here and stomp these guys. <clears throat> That'd be nice. Species enhanced. Okay, species enhanced. Who else do we have? Keep going. What do we have? So we got a bunch of you guys, you guys, you guys. Half Evandari. Oh, modify template. These guys. Ah, oh, brother. <laughs> really? Really paradox. Situation log updated. You don't play your own game. You don't see how annoying some of this UI crap is. That's the only conclusion I can ever come to on a situation like this is that I just feel like they must not play their own game. Because if they did, they'd experience that and they'd immediately put a ticket in and they'd say, "Whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa! We got to get this fixed." <laughs> the routine ecological study of a colony Adamara stumbled upon a strange fungal life form. Dispose of them. <laughs> Species enhanced. God, it just scrolls up every time. All right. Situation log updated. When you see that in in software development, what we call this friction. Usually, it's in reference to the development tools you're using to make software. If the tools cause a lot of friction, it makes your job harder. But in this case. It's friction in in being able to manage Species this. Species enhanced. It's difficult because that thing keeps scrolling all the way up, and it's just like, come on, man. Situation log updated. Stop doing that. <clears throat> Leave it where it is. Don't mess with this. I got this screen open. I'm where I want to be. <clears throat> friction is just... Or the Rufari. We need to modify it. Oh, you don't have a template. Okay. Species and <laughs> The Rufari Guardians. That's right. The Rufari Guardians. Hey, guess what? We're actually going to make you, like, really awesome. So. We will create a bunch of you. Make you better. Situation log updated. Four months. Okay. Let's go back here. Research. We're slagging behind on that. <clears throat> Mm. My throat. This time of year. Worst. The worst. I'm trying to get it all. So what's going on here? Enigmatic Fortress. Ooh. 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 
we do that, head over there. It takes some time. We'd have to send a ship way over there. It'd be kind of hard. Is there an easy access route? That's blocked off. Oh, it'd take a long time to get there, wouldn't it? There's one over here. Where does that go to? to Research there. complete. Hmm. Not easy. The Sidron Index. I'm sure they like having the big old pimple of us right here. Don't they? It's just bringing them all kinds of joy. <laughs> you bastards. Okay, ships. What do you need? Straggles? You got three more of those? Make them. Let's see if we can get our ships finished. The gift fleet. It says you're at 202. But your blueprint is 226. <sighs> because what else is that? Oh, this Zealot class ship. Something else is weird about that, though, isn't it? If you did like four more of these, that would fill it up. <laughs> you click that button and then it goes away. Why does it do that? I click the button to upgrade and it goes to Raging Sea. Anybody at Paradox want to explain to me why it does that? Because you hate me? Colors fade is always so critical about our game. Let's throw in some extra code there to screw with him. I just don't understand. Really don't understand. You guys, this is a command limit, 2020. <clears throat> okay. This is what? Crashing wave. It says it's 156 at 230. It's got two Titans. Fleet size. Command limit usage. Okay, you ready? Reinforce that fleet. Okay, you guys, how come you can't just go to Mega Shipyard and this is the other thing Species I don't understand. Enhanced. So they can't go there. So can a, can a shipyard only handle so many ships? I guess that's the problem, isn't it? It's like I can't get anybody around there. Well, that's too bad. <laughs> if you want to dock all those guys and not take the cost to maintaining them, you got to put them in other shipyards. Oh, well. What do we have here? So this one, Gulk Furky. Get rid of that template. We can. You can get rid of the template. Good luck. Situation log updated. <laughs> Species and I am by no means a user interface expert, but. I feel like I have some handle on Situation how to make a updated. UI that's not frustrating to the user. And that's not it. Okay, you guys, Raging Tide. Wait a minute. You know what I'm going to do with you? You three battleships. You're going to come down here and help these guys. Come down here. Or come down. Yeah, sure. Go that way. That works. Cause do we still need you for... I don't know that we need these guys for that. Two hundred and eighty six days. The Galactic Custodian. When decisive action is needed, a member of the council can be elevated to the position of Galactic Custodian. 
The custodian is granted. Species so enhanced. Alright. Oh, look. There's the Agarians. Who are the Agarians? These guys have been uplifted. Agarians. Well. What is this? They're proles? They're not researchers. Oh, really? They're proles. Very strong. They've been uplifted. They have massive damage. They have, not massive, extra damage from our minerals and jobs. So, if you don't want them to be researchers and you just want them to do this, resources from jobs, you could just, uh, you could nerve staple these guys. Nerve stapled. You need some more trait points, though. You'd have to take something off. Like, very strong. So, nerve staple them. <clears throat> and you can't, yeah, you can't. You say you can make them strong, and then what else could you do? Defense army damage. Don't need to be leaders. So you do that. Okay. They can work the menial jobs. Oops. But you gotta go back there and modify this and change it to that. Update template. That's a situation log updated. <laughs> This episode's gone on long enough. It certainly has. <laughs> it's the year 2463, folks. We're forging ahead. The crisis will be here sometime. I promise. <laughs> Maybe not. Who knows how Paradox's code works. Pretty good from humble beginnings. So we're going to be the Galactic Custodian next episode. So I'll see you then. Thanks for watching, as always. Drop your question comments down below. Subscribe to the channel. Thumbs up the video. I'll see you next time.